Hey, how's it been? How you doing lately? Now today I just approached a topic that is just really bugging my mind right now. And you wanna know what? I just thought you wanna know what? I'm just gonna speak it out. And this topic comes from comic book movies. Two to be exact that are coming out this year. And today I'm gonna talk about why I am excited for Black Adam and not Black Panther Wakanda Forever. Now, before you get mad at me and start flying down with your vulture saying, How dare you? You're just a Marvel hater. Now, I'm not being like that. I want to love the Marvel movies, and I really do. From the deepest depths of the bottom of my heart, I really want all these movies to be good, but really, they just have mostly been misattempts, some of these movies. Some of them have been good, but not most of them. But I'm just going to give you a brief conversation. I don't want this video to be that that long. It's not going to be some type of video essay. I just want to make this brief and quick as possible as I can. So here is why I'm excited for Black Adam and not Black Panther Wakanda forever. Now, first off, now, both of the trailers have been dropped. Black Adam's trailer was dropped, like, a month ago, and the Wakanda Forever trailer dropped, like, two weeks ago, and both of the trailers, one of them, I know, is gonna be amazing now. I'm just gonna talk about both individually. First, we have Black Adam, which comes out pretty soon in the next, like, two months, and Black Adam, now, that looks like a film. That looks like has great people working on it and it looks like it just might be crafted into a masterpiece now it might not be perfect but hell i'll take what i can get this movie looks like it feels like it's respecting the source material and everyone around it is having a good time and dwayne johnson in the in the trailers he just looks like he's having a blast and i just cannot wait to see what comes out of this movie because I am just really excited for what this movie holds. Because most of these DC movies recently, everything from Aquaman to Shazam to the Suicide Squad, have just felt like everyone just gets to do what they want and bring out the visions they want for all these movies. And I just cannot wait for Black Adam. Black Panther Wakanda Forever, on the other hand, now, I just was not gonna be excited for this movie no matter what even if you gave me a million dollars i was never going to be excited for this movie when the trailer dropped i will admit it did surprise me only slightly but my god it just does not look like it's gonna be good personally it just feels like it's unfocused and nothing is gonna happen and it doesn't feel like it's gonna go in the right direction everyone hopes it's gonna be like i I think there's a lot of talent in this movie, but it feels like they're holding back, especially with the elephant in the room, which is Chadwick Boseman's passing. Now, I get that's an issue. I know that was an unexpected thing to happen, and him passing does set a conflict here, and I can understand that, but to not recast the character just feels very dumb. Now, I get they want to respect his legacy, but come on, just recast the character. It's not going to hurt. To recast the character because having a Black Panther movie without the title character just feels ridiculous. Just recast the character. What are you doing, Marvel? And not to mention, while I do think this movie is going to be pretty bad, not like She Hulk bad, but, but this just does not look like a good movie. The trailer does feel like it is going to be made well, but as a movie, probably not. And one of the reasons why I'm not really excited for this movie is the fact that they're just ignoring everything, and it just feels like it's there to set up other movies, like whatever the upcoming Avengers movies are going to be. It just feels like it's trying to play in a role, but it doesn't feel like it's going to have anything to it. It might have the emotion, but miss attempts. It does not feel like anyone is having any fun. The director, I don't think, is gonna give out his entire vision. It just feels like this movie is just coming out just to get more money. And honestly, I don't really think this sequel should be made. It should be cancelled if well, I care, because honestly, 
If you're not going to recast the character, what is the point of having a sequel to a movie that I honestly was never a big fan of? Yeah, you can hate me as much as you want, but I just never liked the first Black Panther movie, and this movie just does not feel like it's going to do it for me. But Black Adam, on the other hand, I actually feel like has a lot of potential going for it. It feels like everything is going to be done right. Maybe. Hopefully I'm right. I really want Black Adam to be great, and it looks great. The trailers have all been fantastic, and I really just cannot wait for what this movie holds. And if Black Panther Wakanda Forever is good, I hope it is. If, I hope I am slightly wrong. I hope it's at least better than the first film, but I don't know. It just feels like we got another bad MCU movie holding for us. And it just doesn't feel like they're really caring at all and not putting any effort into it and just releasing it for the heck of it. And that is just a little sad. But, I don't know, if your comments or opinions down below, what movie are you more excited for? Black Adam or Black Panther? Wakanda forever. Personally, I'm obviously on the Black Adam stand, but if you're more excited for Black Panther Wakanda forever, okay, go ahead and be more excited for that movie. Just, personally, I just, that's just my opinion. Well, as always guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope to see you guys next time for another video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and peace and take care.